All right, so we're live. What's up, guys? Well, live, live recording on StreamYard. It's been a minute. How you guys been, my brothers? OG Fitness here, Hong Nguyen. Hey, today's video, <laughs> I want to give you guys my take on who I think would win, um, you know, for again, Elon Musk versus uh, Mark Zuckerberg. And as well, how each of them could win, possibly win, like the keys to victory. So let's start with um, our buddy uh, Elon Musk. Now, Elon is a lot, lot bigger than, uh, what's his face, uh, Zuckerberg. He's uh, 90 kilos, so that's, uh, I don't know how much that is in pounds, but uh, let me do some quick math for you guys here. Uh, bup, 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 bup. All right. Elon's 90 kilos, so that's times 2.2. That's 198 pounds. So let's just call it 200 for, you know, round off numbers. And Zuckerberg is 70 kilos, which is uh, 154. Let's call it 155, just to remember, okay? So that's like a, let's see, between, you know, 155 and 200 pounds, you're talking uh, 45 pound difference. Now, with that said, though, there is a big age difference. Uh, Zuckerberg, if I'm not mistaken, is uh, 39 years old. And uh, Elon is uh, 50. Wait, let me check the stats here. He's 51. So 51 minus 39. So we're talking 12 year difference. Now, honestly, man, I think it doesn't really matter all that much. 51. I mean, Elon, yeah, he's a little bit, uh, you know, on the fat side, but you know, 10 years. And I feel as though he still seems like he's in shape. He doesn't smoke and all that. He probably doesn't take drugs. You know, he probably doesn't, well, he probably does drink a little bit here and there, but probably not much, you know, because he's always busy working. So I don't think it's such a big deal, you know, and and then after that, there's there's Zuckerberg. I mean, yeah, he's 39, but he, he's never really done anything in his life, as far as I know, uh, in terms of you know athletics and sports and martial arts and all that. Uh, so I mean, he's not that busted up. I don't think Elon is that busted up either. So there's a huge weight advantage and a huge height advantage as well. So Elon's like six uh, six feet, right? Six feet, uh, six one, something like that. Let me just double check for you guys. So I'm not saying anything too crazy. Uh, where is our buddy Elon? I got the stuff here. Yeah, he's dude. He's 6'2". Six 6'2", two. Six two and Zuckerberg's called 5'8". Right? So right there, height difference, weight difference, all you know, advantages for Elon, of course. So the way I would, I think Elon would win. And I'll explain to you guys why. Now... Elon will win just because of the size advantage and also because he was on the Joe Rogan uh, podcast. I, I don't know if it was the first one, the second one. I'm not sure if he's been there the third, uh, like a third time or not. But he did mention that he trains in martial arts. He's had trained in martial arts. So he's done uh, Taekwondo, which is okay, whatever, you know, um, you know, at least he has, he might still be able to kick. Um, he's done Kaiokushin karate. That's a hard style of karate, guys. Kaokushin guys are a little bit insane. You know, they, they're, they're very, very conditioned. Uh, their bodies and all, they, they hit really hard. And, yeah, they're, they're, they're kind of crazy, man. If you guys don't know what Kaokushin is, <laughs> just just type it in uh, YouTube. You'll, you'll see. And guess what? He also has done judo. And he also has done uh, Brazilian jiu-jitsu. Now, how long... Did he spend in you know each of these arts? We don't know because he didn't disclose that. We don't have any information. Uh, at least I didn't find any. And he did he did train a little bit with uh, Lex Friedman, and Lex Friedman said he was very impressed by Elon's power, speed, athleticism, um, you know, strength. So hmm, yeah, he might be low key training there, you know, uh, for a minute. <laughs> And then you got Zuck, and, and also like Elon is kind of, I think he's he's less of a geek. Like they're both nerds, but Elon is a lot less of a geek than Zuckerberg. So Zuckerberg is a geek in the sense that like he's not very physical, whereas, 
or has the, that that capacity, maybe because he he hasn't really done any sports in his life. I know we'll get to him uh, soon enough. So I think that and Elon, like he, he talked about, you know, like having a rough childhood, you know, because he did get bullied a lot and he had to fight and all kinds of stuff. So I feel as though there's something with Elon, like the way the way he is, the way he talks. There's something in his eye, like you, you know, the guy can. I think he's a little bit, you know, a little bit crazy as well, man. That he could, he could, uh, he would fight. You know, he's he's not he ain't afraid to fight. So the keys to victory for Elon would be to, in my opinion, he should, he should just fo focus on sprawl and brawl because he has the size advantage. It's going to be very hard for like if he just learns how to, you know, basically not get taken down, you know, and and then just 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 punch him out, man. Kind of use kicks and punches. He'll be good. That's that's. I think that's what that's all he'll really need. And of course, if he has obviously some like ground defense, so like if he gets to the ground, if, if Zuckerberg tries to take him down, he has to be able to defend the takedown. And of course, if he does get taken down, he has to be able to get back up quickly. And and yeah, and then as soon as it's on the feet, he has like a big advantage. He has reach advantage for sure. If he knows how to kick, if he could, you know, knows how to punch. Um, and he has his judo background too, so yeah. Like if he decides if they get up into if they get into a clinch and Elon throws Zuckerberg, well, he, if he if he just stays on top, it's done, you know. Um, yeah. So yeah. Oh, that's what I was saying. He seems like more of a violent man than 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 uh, Zuckerberg. That's just my take on it. I feel as though he has that violence, whereas I don't think Zuckerberg has that man, you know, because he's a geek. He's not, not as violent as you know, whereas 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 Elon is is, is a gangster man. Like, uh, <laughs> okay, so that's how Elon would uh, beat the heebie-jeebies out of um, Zuckerberg. I think his his victors would be you know basically sprawl and brawl, not get taken down, sprawl out, stay on top. If he does take a uh, mark down, uh, and of course if he gets taken down, get back up quick quick you know and it just go back at it right it would be as simple as that my whole strategy for elon would be to obviously work on his cardio but really just but his cardio his fighting cardio and and make him very efficient in um in those movements right not really like jog or anything like that like you don't need that in my opinion like i think you just need to go get in a lot of rounds and that's going to make you more efficient at uh, your movement patterns you know your your sprawling your your boxing your kicking and all that, your clinch work, your judo throws, getting on top, getting back up, you know, all that. So just focus on that a lot, like, you know, and of course, um, yeah, like that That would be it, man. And uh, add in a little bit of um, uh, cage uh, cage work here and there, you know, because that, that could happen as well. And and yeah, that's it. I think he would uh, he would take it easily, right, if he, if he just focused on that. Now, with that said, okay, how would Zuckerberg win? Well, Zuckerberg, like, even though he's a geek, he did take up Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu and he competed as well. I think it's been like a year, but I looked at the videos of him training um, and he, uh, he's a beginner, you know? So yeah, he sucks. Like, you know, I think a lot of people like who trade a lot uh, for a while now have experience in, in, uh, in MMA and, and, and BJJ. I mean, yeah, like I'm not... Uh, of course he sucks. He's he's new. You know, it's only been a year and he hasn't really ever done anything in his life. But you know, he still looks decent for a beginner. And he did compete and he won. So that's 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 something, man. So okay, how would Zuckerberg win? Man, I think he would he should do the uh leg lock thing. Definitely. Like do it like what was that UFC fighter? Man, I forgot. But it's a jujitsu guy, and all he did was just like roll under people's legs and Kill hook them. <laughs> um, not, not the death squad one. There was another one. I, I forgot. But sorry about that, guys. But if you guys know, then just you know, type it in the, the comment section. So if I was Zuckerberg, I would be like, okay, man. All I'm gonna focus on is not getting knocked out. So developing a great uh, defense movement and entry and setup to get in, right? Get Elon down. Or if you can't really get him down, like just dive into his legs and, you know, uh, Ashigarami him. So Ashigarami, for those who don't know, is basically like leg entanglements. Um, 
you know, so you do that, boom, make him fall, heel hook him, and that would be the name of the game, in my opinion. Because standing up, I think Elon has a big advantage because of his martial art background, uh, because of his size, his reach, his, uh, I think he's more ferocious, man. Like I said, he's more a violent person, <laughs> has the more potential for violence. That's what I'm saying. You know, he's sending rockets up to the moon and, and crazy shit like that. And, you know, Tesla and, you know, he tweets whatever the hell he wants. You know? <laughs> he's amazing. So then, yeah, Zuckerberg, I think if I were preparing him, uh, his keys to victory would be, man, get in between those legs quick, quick, you know, walk like closing the distance without getting knocked out, uh, you know, diving into those legs, you know, getting Elon to the floor, heel hooking him, and that would be game over. So what do you guys think? Do you think, first of all, is this fight going to happen? I feel it, it's, I, I think uh, if somebody backs out, it's going to be, it's going to be Zuckerberg, man. I think he would be the one who would back out. But tell me what you think if you guys think this is going to go through or not. And if so, who do you got and why? Right? And uh, yeah, so let's, let's you know, chit chat about it, break it up uh, in the comment section. And uh, yeah, so I can't wait to see what you guys have to say, man. All right.